the first time walking into an edible schoolyard garden, you kind of get super excited and curious about what's inside of every bed and you want to smell and touch everything. It really brings the child version of yourself back because all you want to do is explore and that's exactly what we want from our students. There are streets in New York City that do not have trees and so you come to Edible Schoolyard and you're actually putting your hands in dirt for the first time. That's pretty magical. I definitely think that our program brings creativity and makes the imagination come to life and you really become one with the environment and that's what this is about is to understand this earth that we live on and how we're connected to it. You know, I always think about all of our school communities and our gardens as little ecosystems. You'll see butterflies flying around me, bees, and then there's kids. That's the ecosystem, right? That's, we're all a part of this and they love it, they enjoy it, and they take care of it. And I think that's key. When the Edible Schoolyard program started, I was very excited. I was happy to know that the kids would be exposed to fresh food. A lot of the students are not aware of where food comes from and I thought it was great for them to get that experience to know that food is grown and it's not always just store bought. We are trying to show them that food can be nutritious and delicious as well. We're trying to marry all these various concepts and to show them how they make sense in their lives. If we get them early, and this can become a part of their lifestyle. I think that this is just um, a really good way to introduce this to them in a way that's fun and engaging. Edible Schoolyard's mission is to bring edible education to all New York City students. How we do that is by offering hands-on gardening and cooking education throughout the New York City public schools. Our model, our philosophy is to get their hands dirty and to allow them in the kitchens, in our classrooms, and in our gardens. We believe that if you can do it, if you can see it, you will start to practice it and it will follow you long term. It's not about introducing kids all the time to new things, it's introducing them to things that they're already familiar with in different ways. Every time when I come out of after school, I stay over here and look at the garden and see all the bugs and stuff. You gotta eat some vegetables and stuff make it bigger and stronger. My mom always tell me, eat, eat some lettuce and tomatoes before I eat my ice cream. When I think about the solutions to bringing more health and food to people, I think about why doesn't it matter enough and how can we allow more students to have the ability to really develop their own relationship and preferences for the food that we grow here at Edible Schoolyard. Food to me is health and if we start looking at it that way, I think we can start prioritizing it more in our schools and in our communities.